Okay, you guys. I'm getting all these calls. Anyways, you guys. Um, just all kind of stupid calls. I don't know how my number. It's talking about car warranty and shit. Okay, but anyways, you guys. Um, I'm going to the gynecologist. Uh, have my physical. I do that every year. Y'all should do it too. And also, uh, I'm going to get back on the birth control. Um... I used to take this really good birth control where I go three months without a period. I loved it. I loved it. It was the best birth control. Only birth control that ever worked for me where I didn't have side effects. So I, I'm going to have to go back on it. It's the only thing that worked. Like over the years, ever since I was a teen, well, after a teen, I didn't really get on birth control till after school. I wasn't frisky or I ain't gonna say frisky I just wasn't like looking for boys or whatever um but anyways and even when I got on birth control I got on birth control because they told me I was anemic um so I needed to get on birth control so I went I have many problems with birth control pills like I always had side effects or they would make me moody or I just didn't feel good the only one that I was taking, and I'm not going to mention the name of it, but it's one that I took for a whole year, and it was amazing. I never had any problems with it. I like the fact that I went three months without a period. I only had four periods a year. Amazing, okay? And the period was very short. It would be like two days. Um, so, I'm going back on it. It worked. And I don't know why I stopped. I stopped because I know why. It's just complicated. But now I know it was a little bit more to it. I don't think it was all. I don't really think it was just the birth control that caused that. Um, let me pay for my stuff, y'all. All right, so I got me some French fries. And I'm going to have to sit. I'm literally going to sit in the parking lot just kind of eat these things really quick because I can't eat going down the road. Gotta keep my eyes on the road. So, yeah, you guys, I mean, that's the next thing I got to do after I get, uh, well, it'll be before my, no, my appointments are to get the, um, I get my biopsy, um, I have an appointment on the 2nd, the 3rd, and the 4th. And then I have my biopsy on the 8th. And then I have my um, physical. And y'all have been everywhere where I need to go to get checked out and everything. I'm just trying to get myself in good health, y'all. I'm glad that I feel okay. Like, I, I have my ear conditioning, condition, not air condition, but my ear condition. Um, but I'm feeling okay as far as all the other things except for my knee pain, my leg pain. Um, so I'm very excited to get my medicine today. Uh, I gotta get my cream to put on my knees. And I take a pill every day for inflammation. So I gotta pick up, I gotta pick it up. And so yeah, that's that's what I gotta do today. But y'all, I basically done been everywhere I need to go, except for my dentist appointment. I gotta reschedule well, I reschedule for it. And y'all, it's just I'm taking care of myself, okay? I'm trying to get to the root of my problem. I don't like how I swell. I don't like how I keep gaining weight and then I lose weight. Um, it's good when I lose weight, but it's not good when I swell up. And there's a problem going on, and I just want to get to the root of the problem. So I think we're going in the right direction. Uh, the doctors and all, we're going to find out what's causing all of this swelling and stuff like this. Um, I don't like it. It makes me worry um, a good bit uh, just because who wants to swell up and you don't know what's 
really what what the cause is behind it you know something is causing this i'm not doing it to myself so something's going on right of course of course there's something going on i just got to get to the root of problem and of course y'all with any procedure it takes time we know that it takes time you know you got to have blood work tests all kinds of things y'all know y'all know the steps but while i eat real quick i'm gonna eat these fries because <clears throat> the last time i came here i was here over an hour so i knew i needed to get me something to eat after doing all the blood work and i mean they they really did it and i'm glad that they did because we need to find out here it is the evidence of it just showing that i did go and have blood work done and all of that so i just got me a large fry and this will do this will hold me until supper time because i'm really not hungry but i know i need to eat after you know having so much blood work done i just don't want to get weak and fragile and feel like i'm lightheaded i don't like that feeling nobody does uh it's not a good feeling oh god i go one fry I just lost the fry. Okay, it's okay. <laughs> I like hot sauce on my fries, by the way. Um, I love this hot sauce. It's good. Texas Pete uh, hot sauce. I love it. Um, it's one of my favorite hot sauce. So, we're going to get to the root of the problem. I just feel it. Sorry, I got a, my appointment is due, like right now. But I do need to eat. Sorry, I'm eating fast because I got to get inside. But I need something to eat. But I feel good just knowing that I'm going to be okay. Everything is going to be okay, y'all. Once we figure out what's going on, I get the right proper medication. I'll be back to Sheila. I've been miserable for a long time. Frustrated. Because when your health is not doing good, you don't emotionally feel good. It prevents you from having fun, chilling, and sometimes it makes you angry as hell. Sometimes you start to be somebody that you're not. Because you're so mad and frustrated because you know you know you need help, but you don't know what it is because you're not a specialist. So I'm taking care of myself. Whatever measures it takes, how many doctors I need to see, specialists, I'm going to do it. By the way, I just sanitize my hands. Especially this when I'm eating. I'm almost done, believe it or not. Like, I, I told y'all I'm going to have to eat very fast. Don't want to mess up my top either. It's so pretty. Such a pretty color. Blush pink. I 
Okay. That's what I'm done. Done. That's done. So now I can get inside. Let me wash my hands off with sanitizer. It's my little sanitizer right there. Trying to drink most of my drink. Uh, Y'all, I'm going to be feeling so damn stuffed because I wasn't hungry. I'm drinking all this Sprite, which is a small one. But I don't want to waste my money. There we go. This girl can do it. Okay. All right. So, uh, excuse me. Let me get inside. Go see the hematologist. See what he want me to do. And I'll be back, you guys. I might talk to y'all while I'm in the room. Okay. Let's go get some health care. All right.